I'm Anil Kumar. Let me thank all my viewers and subscribers for posting excellent questions and providing useful feedback. Now my video on square root of numbers without calculator has been very popular. Based on that, we have got many questions. The question here is, find square root of 0 0.0484 without calculator. Now we are going to find the square root using two methods. So we'll say method one and method two. Method two will be uh, my popular method, which is uh, special division, right? So method two will use special division. And method one will be using estimate. Okay, so let's begin with special division so that when we have an exact answer, we can actually estimate better, right? Okay, so we are doing method two first, special division. In that, I'll review the concept. We write the number as such which is 0 0.0484. The grouping of the number is done. That is the next step. Grouping is done from decimal, both sides, in groups of two. So on the left side, we only have zero. So we'll bother about the right side, groups of two. So these are my two groups. Now we have to look for a number which can divide into the first group. And since we are doing square root, we have to write the same number in these two places. So it becomes clear the number has to be 2, right? Okay. Uh, before jumping in here, uh, you see 0 here, right? And we picked up a group after decimal, so I have to put decimal. Does make sense. Okay. So the number is 2. So we'll write 2 as a divisor and also in the quotient part. 2 times 2 is 4, so we'll write the number 4 underneath. As we do in division, we'll take away, bring down the other numbers, which are, so we get 0 here, but we get 84 from the other side. And we'll perform this division once again. Now, this is a special division. Here, the number which you get here is twice the number on the quotient. 2 times 2 is 4, right? And then we have to again look for a number which will divide into 84 and we have to write exactly the same number. Do you understand? So it goes two times. So I'll writing two here and we'll write two here also. Multiply these. So you get 84 and clearly the remainder which you get is zero. And therefore we can write our answer that the square root of 0 0.0484 is equal to 0 0.22, right? It makes sense. If you multiply 0 0.22 by itself, you expect decimal after four places. So it makes sense, right? So that was a quick way of finding square root of any number. We also see that this is a perfect square, right? So what we saw here is that it is a perfect square. Now for perfect square, I have other videos. I'll provide you a link for those videos also. So we have three different ways of finding square root without using calculator. So let's work out on the estimate side now and we know it's a perfect square so i'll touch upon the perfect square method to derive at the right result we want square root of the number which is 0 0.0484 it could be written as 484 divided by four zeros right 10 i mean you understand 10,000, right? So it is one of the same thing. So finding square root of 0 
is same as finding square root of 484 divided by 10,000. Now 10,000 has four zeros, so I could write this as 1 over 100. And we need to now find square root of 484. So that part I think is absolutely clear. Correct? So we need to find square root of 484. You can do an estimate. We know 20 square is 400, right? 20 square is 400. This is more than 20, right? So let me rewrite this number. We know it is a two digit number here. So 20 squared is 400. So amongst the two digits, we get the number two on this side, tens place. We have to decide about the ones place. We look at these two numbers. Now, in fact, we look at the last digit, which is four for us. Square of what number gives you four? Well, you know that 2 square is 4 and 8 square is 64. Now, both these numbers end with a 4. Do you see that? They all end with 4. So, I could have two things here. Either I could have 4, I mean, sorry, I could have 2 or 8. Both end with 4, right? So, I could have 2 or 8. Which one to choose? For that, the trick is, you multiply 2 by the next number and compare with 4. So we know 2 times 3 is 6. This number is lower, so pick the lower. So we get 2 here. You get the idea, right? So pick the lower. So that is how you get perfect square. So you can now write this as 1 over 100 times 22, right? 22 is our number. So I hope you understand this part, how we selected 22, correct? So it is more than 20, ending with 4. There are only two possibilities, either 2 square or 8 square. Since it is a lower number, I mean 2 times 3 is 6, we compared with this number. 4 is lower than 6. So we selected the lower number, 22. 22 divided by 100 is indeed 0 0.22 so we get the same answer is that clear so that is how you could find square root of a number without using calculator and not wasting much time so once you know these tricks it is really easy to figure out what is the square root i'll provide you with the links which will discuss this method in detail so i was kind of given you it in short but here is a square root method, special division, which you can adopt for any number. It may or may not be a perfect square. So I hope you understand and appreciate it. Feel free to write your comments and share your views. If you like and subscribe my videos as my friend does, it'll be great. Thanks a lot.